Hello. As promised, I will be showing you the inside and booting up my unused HP DL360 server at the moment. Previously, I've, I've shown my sold HP DL60G3. This one's slightly older than my previous one which I bought for an incredibly cheap price of about 50 quid. Now, it works perfectly. I don't currently use it though, because I've got no need for it. I just have it here just as a standby if, if anyone needs to use it. So if we quickly just open it up and I'll show you what, what, what we have inside. We have dual power supplies which are both installed and work. We've got I've got dual Intel Xeon processors, which are 2.06 GHz each, which makes up um, 4.12 GHz, which is extremely powerful for something which only costs 50 quid. We've got 2 gig RAM, which obviously I can put two more in, or I can take them out and replace them with 4 gig each. We've got a, a IOL code, uh, card, integrated lights out, with room for the expansion of another one. All the fans work correctly. Okay, so let's go ahead and boot this baby up. Oh, and it's got a 72.6 gigabyte um, hard drive at the front with room for one more. Previously, my old one had room for five more hard drives, which would include two hot swap and two two backups. Sorry, on a minute. So let's put in the power. Right. Okay. This isn't actually on. This is just in. So if we go ahead and start it. There is actually three fans under there. We've got three fans there which will work. And then this is um, a Linux configured but it, it's got, got not, nothing on board it's just a completely bone dry server which has obviously got a lot of power and I can deploy it for web hosting or um, software ok thank you very much bye